Today, I will review for you, the 8 red necklaces, the hell heart, please follow my channel and send a thousand times of happiness to your loved ones. Hello everyone, I'm in DL. First is hell heart, Fortio, this is the most widely used necklace, even by mages, simply because it boosts character strength, increasing HP and physical attack, mages usually have low HP, so they really need this necklace, naturally, this necklace is suitable for all classes, and it suits druids the most, a class heavily reliant on strength. Second is Hellheart, Dextro, it increases the agility stat of the class, which helps increase attack power, critical hit rate, hit rate, and evasion. If you notice, when wearing the necklace, the evasion rate is 35%, but without it, it's only 28%. As for the critical hit rate, it's 26% without the necklace, and with the necklace, it increases to 30%. Third is Hellheart, Safo, it boosts the intelligence stat, which helps increase magical damage, resistance to abnormal elements, and mana. So, this necklace is only suitable for those playing magic classes. Fourth is Hellheart, Pyro, it increases fire damage by 2% each time you deal, or receive fire damage. This suits classes that use the Fire Dragon set, as this set deals fire damage to itself, and enemies, such as Pyro Knight, Heretic, etc. Fifth is Hellheart, Electro, it boosts the damage of other elements, when attacking an enemy affected by electric shock, or abnormal electrical shock, if you combine this with any boons that deal electric damage, it's suitable for all classes, especially elemental mage classes, greatly increasing damage. Sixth is Hellheart Cryo, this is an ice themed necklace that increases critical hit rate, and critical damage, however, it only increases the critical hit rate, when the enemy is frozen, definitely critically hit. For enemies not frozen, the crit rate will be reduced by half, meaning, it's only suitable for classes using ice magic, or you can combine it with some boons that freeze enemies. Seventh is Hellheart, Tenebro. It increases dark damage, but you have to endure designated damage, meaning you'll be able to kill enemies easier but also be more susceptible to death. I'm not sure which class to combine this with. Eighth is Hellheart, Vano, this is a quite powerful necklace, I think it's suitable for fighting level 8 dark gods because it reduces enemy damage, and has a chance to cause enemies to miss, however, it's only suitable for classes playing with poison, like druids, or you can also use it with toxic boons, which I think would be effective, okay? After reading about these 8 red necklaces, which one is your favorite? What do you want to see next? Please leave a comment below. Alright. That's it for today's video. Thank you for your enthusiastic support. Thank you, everyone.